Now, uh, if you saw one of my vlogs back in the summer, uh, I told you I wanted to get down here and photograph some ferns. And that's what, uh, that's what we're going to attempt to do. Uh, but it's not looking all that promising. Uh During the meanwhile. During the meanwhile. No, 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 no. Well, hello. It is. Uh, I'll just turn you on a second. There you go. It's uh, pup number. What's that? Pup number one. My daughter, daughter playing with uh, Arbuthnut, our adopted pussy cat, and uh, we thought we'd take advantage of the last day of what's supposed to be sunny weather and come down the woods, which if you haven't been down here for, when's the last you came down? Three months ago? Two months ago? Checks? Yeah. Yeah, quite a long time anyway. She's playing with a cat now. And uh, we checked to see if our uh, bird feeders are still here <laughs> or not. And also uh, top some stuff up. And also, um, uh, what was I going to say? Oh, that's right, yeah, I wanted to test out this uh, Osmo Pocket 3 in these dark, dark wooded areas to see what the uh, low light performance is like. And uh, so I know the GoPro used to struggle a little bit, don't you, with uh, with noise and artifacts and whatnot. So let's see how uh, let's see how this copes. Uh, and then hopefully, again, okay, as you said, um, I want to try and find some ferns and um, get some pictures, some images of, uh, you know, like patterns, uh, textures, you know, that sort of thing in, in the ferns. So we'll see what we can see, what we're heading. I'll turn you around again now, because we're nearly at, uh, nearly at where we need to be. There we are, there's Arbuthnut leading the way. And this is our little, our little dingly dell, <laughs> where we've got our... Uh, well, hopefully still got our bird feeders and whatnot. I know one of them, uh, when we came down here, we think a, a squirrel had had. I think a squirrel had had it. Yay, our, our main feeder is still there, Bethan. The main feeder is still up. So we have bought some seed to refill that and some fat balls and some suet uh, for the birds because as I said uh, the forecast for the next few days is for quite heavy rain and if that is the case then um, like a lot of the bugs and stuff that they eat will be washed out of the trees and uh, they'll have a precious little grub to eat. So. I'm going to need to uh, stop recording for a second now and uh, fill these feeders up. Right, so that's the uh, the feeders all filled back up with some bird seed, some suet pellets, uh, a slab of lard and some fat balls for the birds. Now I have spotted some nice ferns down here. They're tiny. Last time you were down here there was like bushes bushes of ferns and now it's just uh, a couple of little bits and bobs but they are quite nice they got like a nice variegated pattern on the on the the fronds so I'm going to try and uh, see if I can isolate one of those against the background and try and get an interesting an interesting composition it's very still down here so that should make for either using uh, smaller aperture or focus stacking a little bit easier uh, and I can oh, a, there is um, a fern down there with another leaf on it but it's not not very attractive I'll show you now it's not worth photographing and then there are some nice sort of lime green ones like new growth coming out 
So let's, uh, let's, let's pop down here and have a little look. Turn you around again. And I fall to my inevitable death, probably. Oh, God. Oh. Be careful. It's not that... Uh, the ground is not very firm underfoot. I'll show you this. There's the one with... Like uh, a leaf that's fallen on it. I don't think that's worth. That's not worth taking a picture of. Had the um, had the brown leaf been a little fuller, um, then it might have made for a more interesting composition. But I'll show you these variegated ones. These are quite nice. Ow! And stung. Uh, these variegated ones are quite nice, and I think I might get uh, might get an image of one of those now. Uh, that's uh, they're quite attractive, aren't they, with the green and the brown? So I think what I will do is um, try and get a picture uh, of that. Well, I'm not sure if those uh, if those fern photos are worth it, even with the inclusion of that uh, that woodlouse and that uh, oh, I know, crawled. Oh. Sorry for the close-up. That, uh, that crawled into the scene. Trouble with that being that uh, very dark down here. So trying to get a picture, a sharp picture or something. Let's move in even slowly. Uh, it's quite tricky. So we're going to uh, move on and see if you can see anything else worth photographing. You never know, you might see a mushroom. <laughs> Imagine that, a mushroom in the woods. Well, we haven't seen any for ages down here. So, it'd be a, it would be a, a special sight. Right. That's our pathway back out. Oh, well, why is it always uphill on the way home? <laughs> Should have bought a house at the bottom of a hill, shouldn't we? Again, no great big fern bushes around though, which is a disappointment because I bookmarked them in the spring to come back down here in the summertime and get some nice pictures. Uh, but now, whether the, the council have been down here with their machines and cropped everything back, I don't know. But we'll have a look on the way out. We'll, we'll go out a slightly different way to the way we came in. And uh, then, uh, there may be some there. This is the spot where I got a little uh, hobbit hole photo back in the spring. One of my favourites from this year, so I'll uh, I'll pop that up. I can't see where, ah, this is where I took it. Right here, so I'll, uh, there we are, just there. I'll, uh, I'll pop that picture up now. You may have seen it before. Apologies if you have. Uh, Bethan just spotted this rather lovely little scene. Uh, it's like these sort of lacy leaves. And they, they've fallen on top of, not a fern unfortunately, but on top of some, uh, I think they're like blackberry bush leaves. The trouble is they are moving quite a lot. Even though there's not much of a breeze, down there, there obviously is. Huh? We try anyway. We try to get a picture. May have to boost the old uh, ISO up a bit. Uh, I think. I think, to be honest, that's just pretty well done, done. You know, there's some very, very, very disappointing images of ferns. I was hoping they could get something really quite, really quite nice down here, but nothing much at all. Oh well. Uh, that's it, I think. Uh, that's the end for this rather pointless vlog. <laughs> if I did get any decent images, uh, I'll share them with you uh, 
sharing with you now. Uh, until next time then, just uh, just be nice, all right? Ta-ra. <laughs>